Okay, now we're in our second featured hole, and David, this is called the Signature One yeah. of the Calera Springs Club, right. Golf and Country Club. Why is that? Number one is the most difficult, it's Handicap One. Okay. And then next, it's going to be lined up with the fire trees on the left and on the right. So when it blooms, it's all red. When the flowers fall, it's going to be carpeted. The approach shot will be fantastic and really scenically beautiful. Mm, yeah, when you look at that view. Yeah, it looks an island green. Eh? Island green. Island okay. green. So it's 557 yards, handicap one. Yeah. Okay, this is hole number six, remember that. And uh, okay, so how do we try to get a par in a handicap one? That's What's what, the, that's what the caddy says, <laughs> hit it straight. <laughs> <laughs> but that's the most difficult shot in golf. <laughs> okay. We naturally fade or slice. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, so let's tee it up. Bye bye. Probing, probing. Okay, <laughs> hey, David, our, my tee shot was short, yeah. but more or less in the middle. So from this point, I still can, I actually thought it was that green but no it actually goes down some more yeah you have to cross a lake cross a lake okay yeah. so it's it's a it's an island green right so an island green okay from here what do we need to do to be able to what we'll lay it up first you have to lay it up because uh it's still 200 yards away from the lake okay so 200 yards okay yeah and, and where, put it a little bit aim? on the right so on that the, right the ball side. will bounce to the middle oh, okay because okay. the fairway is undulating towards the, towards uh, the from um, the high right side down to the left side. okay Aim right. Like that. That's right. Uh, that's why I said a bit to the yeah, right. Yeah, to the right. The, the other, like two bunkers there on the hill. Yeah. Actually, you're really aiming a bit to the left. Yeah, no? If you can't make your shots go straight, you will quick fixes. David, this is your third shot. You can see the green right from here. How are you going to play it? I'll go for it. Go for it. Always go for it. It's life, right? Yeah, you yeah, gotta true, lose. So true. do you enjoy winning later? True. I have to lose a ball first, <laughs> which actually, I, I hit a pretty good shot. Just aimed a little bit too left. So I ended up hitting the car path and going out of bounds. My caddy, Bebot, the beautiful Bebot over here, is <laughs> tells me that it's 150 yards. Thank you. Recovery, yeah. <laughs> Every failure, there's a marking success. With this hole being a handicap one and an Arnold Palmer signature hole, it's not a surprise that I scored a bogey again. Ah, this is the hole where delay of play can happen. The view will leave you in an inevitable stare. Let's proceed to the last hole. David, I just have to ask you, before we move on to our last hole, you know, Lake Caliraya is pretty much, it's famous all around the Philippines. And now I can see, I haven't been here in a while, and I can see up till now, it's still so clean. And not even one plastic bag or anything in the lake. <laughs> Tell me about it. It's a basic principle of uh, if nobody's littering, nobody is required to clean it. True, true, true. There's nothing to clean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're not actually cleaning it. It's just that nobody's littering it. The people around actually really take care right. of the lake. Yeah. Okay, David, we're in our last featured hole. Hole number seven, par three. Yeah. And now you can see the entire, pretty much the entire view of Lake right. Caleraya. And it's 170 yards from the blue tee. Yeah. What are we gonna do? Um, you gotta hit um, 150 yard uh, distance. Okay. Because it's a it's a downhill. Okay. And it's front pin, and you have around 20 yards of leeway in front, and uh, at the back it's only three yards. Three yards, so better short. So better short. Yeah, better. Okay. Yeah. Course management is the key. Let's let's see it. Let's see if we can do it. Okay. <laughs> We're in step number two. So from here, I want to try and uh, save par. Okay. Um, what do we need to do? Um, you pitch a loft shot around 15 yards and okay. let it roll. And let it roll. Yeah. I can see that the, well, the grass is going that, so I need to 
aim it a little bit to the right. Right, and because uh, on, the, on the farther end, it's uh, right to left. Right to left. Yeah. Now, this is a great way to end tea time. Play in the hole with the best lake view. Nice spot! Although you may not get the best score, it's a nice place to breathe the fresh air and take a couple of snapshots with your golf buddies. I can now wrap up my game. Nice spot. <laughs> if you wish to try the Kaliraya Golf Course, you are in luck. They currently accept walk-ins. The green fee for an 18-hole round during the week is 1,120 pesos if you're accompanied by a member. And it's 1,680 pesos if you're not with a member. On weekends and holidays, it is 1,344 pesos with a member. And if not, it's only 2,016 pesos. Other fees that you may want to know if you're playing that 18-hole round are the following. Golf carts are rented out for 780 pesos, caddy fees are 300 pesos, and umbrella girls are 200 pesos. For more information, make sure to visit their website www.kalirayalake.com Another brilliant course tackled reasonably by yours truly. So let's thank David who did not hold back on those tips. Let's wrap up tea time and get golf treat started.